Alright, hello, and welcome to another episode of Crazy Craft. I left off last time with this zombie grinder, which has gotten me 32 experience points so far. And once that text clears, I'll show you something. So I've just been using this for a while, you know, off camera. If you notice how it looks like I only have three hearts on my health bar right now, but you see that two next to it, I actually have one entire full line of hearts. And those three hearts are actually the start of a second line, so I actually have 13 hearts right now. That's what the two stands for. That means that's actually my second row of hearts that I'm starting on, so you can go way over regular health. And I've just kind of made this zombie grinder. You know, some hoppers are picking up some loot from them. I'm getting some interesting stuff from the strange mobs. I also installed another feature here. If I get an infernal mob like this, if... You know, if, even though I'm a hostile mob right now, I think I'm a zombie right now. Ugh. I've turned into about five different kinds of zombies. Even if I hit one of these guys, I get some kind of bad effect from it. So when I do get an infernal mob, something I don't want to hit, I just hit this button here and suffocate them. And that way I don't have to sit there and mess with them and take damage. I mean, the infernal mobs won't actually try to attack me, but if it's one of those infernal mobs that shoots something at you, or something like that, then they'll automatically do it no matter what, so there's still kind of a problem. I think I picked up a couple of amethysts out of here, so let's grab those. But I was just showing you why I installed the... If I get something there I don't want to hit, suffocate them. And this Farlander came down here with me. I think he fell down the ladder. He's offering Enmium Crystal for a golden hoe, which isn't a bad trade. I don't think I have any gold I can trade with him. No, I do not. And while I have 32 experience levels, I did something else off camera. I gotta come all the way down this way. Remember that room with the enchantment table? I kind of marked off where it was. I think there's a brewing stand down here, too. So I think... Yep, XP grinders this way. So when I come back down this stairwell, I'll know where the heck I'm going. I'm back in the yin-yang room. I don't know what... Oh, I got another sign over here. It's been a while since I've been... There's my... What I did was I gathered all the bookshelves that were in these hallways here and just brought them in here and did this enchantment table. I'm going to enchant this amethyst sword. Fire Aspect 2. I was hoping for a couple other enchantments, but hey, that's better than nothing. <laughs> So I do have an enchantment table down here. I forgot where my stairwell was. I didn't pick up this loot yet. Oop, the pink wool, yuck. When he made a comment on that. I could use the stone bricks later on for some building projects I'm planning on doing. I forgot what was in here. I'll pick that stuff up later. It should be pretty easy to find again. There's a lot of stuff I can do with this area. XP grinders this way. I don't know where my stairway went. I think this is the layer that goes down deeper. Yeah. This goes down to that level that creeper spawner was on. Ugh. I don't think the creepers will bother me now, but still, I don't I don't want to see a creeper spawner ever again. That was pretty horrible. I think the potion room was over here. Yep. I got some nether wart. This is right, pretty much right above where that creeper spawner was. Oh god. Oh god. I might be able to sack it now, though. Yeah, I don't think the creepers will bother me now. The spiders will, though, because they're aggro towards you no matter what. Yeah, that creeper doesn't even care. It's playing a torch. So I'd better have some good loot in it. Sorry, spider. So I'm going to have to go down here and find the spider spawner. Oh, it must be over here. Hi, spider. Crap. Oh, well, it's better than being a derp zombie, so... I'd much rather be a spider. I must have turned to a different type of spider. I don't know what's in here. That's taken care of. And I think... Oh, I think that's a trap chest. I better not open that right away. Zombie! Ugh! These new zombies are going to suck. I don't want... Whoa! Fire creeper. Put these all at least three blocks up. What a pain. 
Well, we're gonna have to live with that. Yeah, so let's, there's probably some, let me guess, there's some TNT in this chest or something. I'm gonna dig out the floor here. This might make a good grinder later. Because I'm not gonna kill the killing creepers for gunpowder. That'd be a little bit disastrous. I mean, there isn't any TNT. You think there would be if they're like trapped chests? There gotta be some. Oh, there it is. I'm glad I looked. Figures it'd be the creeper spawner that would have those. So let's get rid of free TNT. I'll take it. It's gonna be kind of hard to find in this world. Since I'm not gonna have access to a lot of gunpowder. Oh, this is meant to blow sky high. Not that that was really a bad thing, but I don't want to be caught in it. Yuck, 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 yuck. I don't want to see that. Really make sure this is all cleared out of here. Yeah, that would suck if you're some unsuspecting person. Yeah, I finally conquered that creeper spawner and you get blown up anyway. That would suck. Come on, stone, just what I always wanted. Make sure all this is cleared out of here before I... Whoa! That is a lot of freaking TNT. Now that I'm a spider, I can't fit into one by one block spots. Ah! Trapped! There we go. Oh, thank you, zombies, for... Those spiders still want to kill me. I'm kind of a greenish spider right now. I don't know what that is. Let's go ahead and block that off. While I check out the loot here. Alright, this should be... Ooh, a diamond. This should be pretty safe. I don't know if I want... Oh, I could use a string for bows and stuff. I hope they have a backpack mod in here. Golden leggings. Potion of swiftness. It's not too bad. I'll take the bread just because it's a food source. I can stay alive down here for quite a while. Let's get away from the spiders. As much as I love them and all. I don't know where the actual entrance was. Oh, at least I can climb up walls and stuff. It's, ugh. I wonder if this goes down deeper. That <laughs> pillar goes all the way down the ravine. Whoa, I don't want to fall down this. That goes down to pretty much lava layer. I don't know what that green stuff is down there. Oh, I might have to go down this way. Fantastic. Oh, there's, oh, there's an infernal mob in there. Maybe let's not go that way. Ah, you can't tear that down, can you, zombie? Nope. I know this is weird, weird to me because I normally put my torches on the floor. Uh, yep, I heard a silverfish. That was not me sniffling this time. Got some good food in there. Get some torches. Thankfully, that loot had lots of torches. Yep, I heard a silverfish, so... If one of you guys heard one last episode, you said my stiffs sound like a silverfish, maybe you actually heard a silverfish. Apparently they're down here. Fun, fun, fun. Oh, crap. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. You know, I'm probably just gonna break that spawner. And there's another thing too, if hostile mobs see you morphing into something else, they will attack you. <laughs> They're like, oh, that's not right. You know, I'm just gonna block this off because I don't wanna die right now. Which I might die anyway. Ooh, I unlocked the hat. 
Okay, they're not getting through now unless they're cave spiders. So as long as the cave spider doesn't spawn, I should be okay. Alright, that zombie's gonna... I don't know what's in here. Crap. Small spider. Oh, fantastic. So there are spiders that get their one by one openings. And I just turned into that spider. Ugh. I guess I turned back into me. That's weird. Oh, no. I'm probably never going to see that stuff again. So now I don't know where that spot is. I think I might, but it's going to take a while to get there. I have no equipment, so... Probably going to cut this off. I'm probably, probably not going to get my stuff back, so... I'm going to sit here and punch through this. Well, I don't think I'm going to be able to rescue my stuff. I've tried five times. There's just too many armored zombies down there, and I have no supplies with me, so I'm going to have to start this over. That was a nice waste of an amethyst sword, anyway. I don't know how that happened. I ran back down there. My stuff was not there. I can't get through all the zombies. There's just no way. Well, I got blocked diamond blocks so I can... Why didn't they put diamond armor on me? I don't remember. So I guess I can start over on that. But I just could not get through anything down there. I kept running down there, running down there. There was... I even tried running away so the zombies would despawn, you know, running away from the area, but wouldn't happen. There's just too many armored zombies down there. I think I picked, they picked up all my stuff and started using it, so that was a nice waste of a sword anyway. So, you get to see me do that, you know, first time around. And I still have my the health that I had, even though it wasn't much of a help down there. I don't know why my game is so slow. I'm like, come on, inventory. There we go. But yeah, I think my stuff's already despawned. I know I tried like five times to go down there. Just would not work. I'm not going to take all these diamonds down there because I think I'll just lose them. If that happens. I don't know why I'm playing so badly today. I'm sorry. I don't even... I have these two torches. That's about it. It's like the zombies just... There's got to be a spawner down there or something that I didn't know about, so... I would like some torches back. Ugh, that kind of sucks. Do I have any lumber in here? That's about it. Well, I don't really have anything except crappy... I can just... I want to just make all diamond tools here. Yeah, I don't know why I'm playing so badly and why I couldn't retrieve my stuffs. Well, I do know why. Because every time I ran down there, there were like four or five zombies waiting for me. It was kind of pointless. I need to figure out a way to get more of those amethysts. That would be good. I might be able to survive for 20 seconds down there instead of 10 now, so... Oh, I'm not taking my diamonds with me. I'll just lose them. There we go. I think the fireflies drop these things, so I wish I had a way to farm them. But it didn't seem like five minutes by the time I got down there and grabbed my stuff, so I don't know what's going on. I mean, I managed to pick it up once and just immediately got killed again. Couldn't... You know, of course, when I picked it up, there was no sword in my hot bar, and there were two zombies attacking me, so I had to sit there and fight them off with my fist, which didn't go over so well. I should have some better armor on me by now. This was the quickest way down. Spider, go away. Not in the mood for you. Really not. Now I can't get it, I'm stuck. Yeah, I dropped my stuff somewhere down in this area. I 
Ah, they're coming out of these doors here. That's the problem. Yeah, I think it was right here, and I dropped it the second time, and it's all gone now, so... I think I ran past it a couple times. Ugh. Just because I don't like you? Alright, can I get through here? Alright, nothing in here worth taking. I already have a zombie spawner. I don't need this. So, that goes. The spider spawner is going to go. There we go. Don't have to worry about that anymore. I probably should have cleared it out right away. Oh, I wish I had some torches. Let me go try to find some coal and I'll be right back. Okay, there we go. Found some coal on the side of this ravine here, so... I don't know what that other ore is. afraid to put up any torches because they're just getting torn down. What's this? Oh, this is gonna go. I'm sick of these armored zombies. I guess I'm a really small spider right now. I don't remember how that happened. Oh, nothing in there. I can probably fall through these holes, so I gotta be a little bit careful. Nope, oh, we got a skull sitting over there. Freaking infernal mobs. Ugh. I'm not gonna mess with those guys right now. That's what the grinder's for. Nothing in here. Nope, and I think we're back at the actual entrance here. But I should have c probably come down. Let me go ahead and get rid of those. And this place is a mess. <laughs> Apparently, that looks like some quartz. Hi, skeleton. That's not going to bother me. As long as I don't get caught mid-morph again. Is that seriously quartz? Yep. Nothing in there. I'll take this stuff. Yeah, there's definitely some kind of spawner around here. What? Mad scientist skeleton? Or is that just a hat? That they're wearing? I don't know. That's kind of weird. I don't know why this entrance is only... Oh, we got wither skeletons, too. Oh, <laughs> mushroom hat. Ah, there it is. Oh, there's a chest behind it. I might save the spawner just because it's so close to the entrance here. Let's see what's in here. Oh, now I get some coal now that I found some, but oh well. Sticks I can take. Chain boots, swiftness, chicken. 
I don't know what a mundane length lengthening catalyst is, but we'll leave it in there for now. There's gonna be so much exploring to do in this place. Poison. Oh, I remember those guys. Rare, tricky, poison, skeleton, the raging. Ugh. Yeah, th these guys, even though they're not technically aggressive towards you, they'll still fire at you, no matter what, so. Probably better just to avoid them. This one is another skeleton spawner. I think that's a wither skeleton. Oh, that'll be useful for wither skulls. Like, not that I ever want to fight a wither again, but... Ugh. Oh, here's a fire aspect sword. I don't know what a standard binding agent is. Oh, there's some gunpowder. Let's dump off some crappy inventory here. You know what, I'm just gonna leave the valuable stuff in this chest for now, just so I don't lose it. Ooh, this can make a good double spawner, eventually. I think it might be a good idea to keep this around. Yeah, we're right next to the stairwell. <laughs> So, let's keep this. I'll come back to it a little bit later here. Skeletons aren't going to sit there and tear down the torches. Now, is this the last level, or are there more? I don't want to imagine what any lower levels would look like. They'll probably be like fire and lava and just all kinds of bad things. Oh, it's a baby skeleton. You <laughs> make like a beep sound. That's kind of funny. Yeah, if I can make a mob grinder out of this and they drop that diamond armor and crap, that would be awesome. Alright, this looks like another... Let me make sure this isn't a trap chest or something. Nope, it's a regular chest. It doesn't have that red border around it. Let's take the torches. Brad, I don't need it at the moment. Oh, spawner. And it's spiders. Fantastic. I never thought I'd gripe about spiders. The spider seriously has 256 health. Are you kidding me? Probably just better bet just to get the heck out of there. Yeah, this is gonna suck. Is that seriously another stairwell? Does this go down even further? Oh, it does. Fantastic. <laughs> oh, looks like we're not far from the entrance. Let's kind of mark this off here. Just so I know where the heck we're going if I come back here. If there's stairwells near other stairwells, I kind of want to know which way to go if I need to come back down. Or back up, for that matter. Any previews below? Oh, what this hold? Is that seriously a blaze down there? Ah, oh, good job. I, yes, it is. Fantastic. Let's get in here. This looks like a little safe zone. Uh, that's kind of a weird glitchy. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Let me regenerate some hearts here real quick. And apparently this is not even the last level. Apparently there's one more that's made out of another stuff, so it's probably where the blazes come from. I don't want to go down there.
I really don't. I think this is all gated, though, so I'm gonna, let's not go down this way, because it sounds like that's where the blazes are coming from. I don't know if they're still aggressive towards me, or... Oh, there's an infernal one in there. Yeah, there must be some kind of spawner in that area. Let me see, are they going to be aggressive towards me? Yes, they are, because... They don't catch on fire like that unless they're ready to shoot at you. Ooh, some diamonds. That <laughs> I don't already have enough. I don't have to worry about the zombies right now. Grab that. I'm gonna free another wart. I might not even have to go to the nether. That would be cool because I hate going to the nether. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. Now what level am I on? I'm on level 10, so this has to be the last layer of this thing. Oh, I don't like think I like that. That lava looks ready to flow out any second. Ooh. Ooh, ender pearls. Knockback one. Channing. Cooked fish. I think I'll keep that for the ender pearl. I'm not going to take the loot yet. I'll come back down when this is all cleared out. I'm not under constant threat of dying. Speed two. Gold. <laughs> I could trade that Farlander up there. Heart piece. I think there's another heart piece back there. If I combine them. Will this give me four? Or a whole heart? If I combine four. Yes, it will. Let's give myself another heart of health here. So I got four in my second row of hearts, which is awesome. Actually, there's a zombie spawner, so let's put that up there. Oh, it's so hard to see in here. Lots of loot, though. Blaze powder, I like that. Looks like that is the end of the hallway. Jeez, we're already going on 27 minutes. This is his ending better than it started. I really wish I would have kept an aim at this sword, though. That would have been awesome. Let's take some bread. Coal. Forgot to grab that. Unless that was a chest I missed. Apparently, the farther down this thing you go, the better the loot gets. Oh, that's just another wart down there. I'm like, turn it. I see this weird shadow over there. I'm like, oh, that's another wart. And I am not going in there because there's probably a blaze spawner and I don't want to die. And if there's a spider spawner in there, I'm not going to be happy. Apparently blazes are still going to be aggressive. I don't even think I have a water bucket. Please say it's not a cave. No, it's a cave spider. Shit. Oh, crap. Oh, I did not want that. Oh, well. No, skeleton caught me morphing, so he wants to kill me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Apparently, blazes don't care what you are, either. Yeah, let's... I saw, like, several spawners in there. Let's not go in that room. Or at least let me block it off. Man, that's gonna suck. I don't have any buckets. I'd like to harvest that nether wart in there. Whoa, hit that. Dang it, why am I laughing because it hit me too? Alright, where was that? I know there's a chest with some iron in it. It shouldn't be too hard to get a lava bucket in here, but that's, it'll light up the room. It won't hurt the blazes, but it'll kill everything else, so... I'm all for trying that. These blaze spawners are really hard to shut down. At least from my experience. I think you have to raise the light level to 15 to shut them down or something. Let's craft ourselves a bucket here. Use what we got. I 
probably could put up these iron bars too. I don't want to be a cave spider. I don't like cave spiders. Yuck. So I think it'd probably be prudent to put this up. Oh, that's not gonna be not gonna be enough. I don't think they can see me through here. Oh, nice one. I mean, I don't like creepers either. That creeper deserved it, but ugh. And I don't want to. I don't want. I don't want to sack the spawner. I really don't. I don't think I want to turn to a blaze either. Does that mean I'll smoke in my face? Probably. Yeah, that would kind of suck. Oh, I don't know what I hit. I seriously hit a blade. Oh! I don't know why that blaze was taking damage. I don't have to worry about the skeletons. I don't think the creepers will attack me. Crap. Ugh. Oh, fantastic. Oh, wonderful. I do have freaking smoke in my face. Oh, dang it. And now I'm taking poison. Go away, cave. I can't even see. Oh, wonderful. Uh, they still want to kill me anyway. <laughs> you know, let's just let these guys despawn. I don't think I can get set on fire or anything. Let's grab some lava. Ooh, right there. See if I can grab a bucket of this if I can see anything. I don't think the lava's gonna hurt me or anything. No, it won't. I'm okay from fire, at least, but I just wish I could freaking... Let me turn the particles down. Alright, that's much better. I turn the particles off so I can see what I'm doing. <laughs> I think I'll let those guys despawn in there. I don't think I can take fire damage now, which is good. That wouldn't make a lot of sense. I can probably go in there and sack some spawners. At least light it up enough so stuff stops spawning. There better be some really good loot in that room. Or is this another one of those rooms? Yep. And there's a cave spider. Wonderful. Can I fly at least? Yes, I can. Get out of my face. Alright, I'm not taking damage from the fireballs, so I might take this opportunity. This is actually a different room than what I was in before. Yep. There's some zombie spawners. Let's get rid of the zombie before he turns down my torches. I gotta be careful what I turn into here. Yeah, it's gonna be really hard to shut this down. Not oh, freaking infernal mobs. Uh, loot's not what I had hoped for. Alright, how many torches do I need to shut this down? <laughs> I've seen people light up blaze spawners before and it's a pain in the butt. That's about what you need. Ooh, I like that. Sorry, ain't gonna work. Alright, I think that was the only room like that. Alright, let's go take care of that other room. 
I think I kind of have that shut down. Oh, that's a skeleton spawner. We don't have to worry too much about that. Now, what way was that other spawner? Was it down here? No, it wasn't. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna have to leave myself a lot of signposts here. I think I should probably end this episode soon because we are going on about 35 minutes. So that might be a good idea. I'll probably split it into two parts or something. Nope, that's not it. Oh, spider spawner, that's gotta go. Alright, I think, yep, we were down this way. I remember putting this gate up. I think the blaze spawner is over here. You know, they can't do a whole lot of damage to me now. I still want to get rid of that for when I come back here. But I might want to do something with that spawner. That and the skeleton spawner. <laughs> oh, you're wasting your energy. Jeez, where are they spawning from? They can still do a little bit of damage to me, but not much. Oh, wonderful. Haha, uh -huh, Cave Spider, you can't get me. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, maybe, but. That's when they drop golden helmets. You know, I think I'm just going to destroy this particular spawner because I, don't, I already have one by the stairwell and I don't think I need a second one. Yeah. Alright, we don't have that problem anymore. It'll stop the annoying noise at least. Alright, let's see what goodies are in here. Diamond pants. I like that. Alright, another amethyst. A nice diamond. Oh, come on! Really? Alright, is there another spawner in here? Yes, sir. Oh, man. No wonder it wasn't working. Alright, I did not see that spawner. I don't know where the cave spider one is. It's gotta be in there somewhere. Anyway, I think we're going to end the episode here for today. I think we got a pretty good haul out of that. Nine blaze rods. Easily enough to make enough eyes of energy to go to the nether. So I think I'll take that. And I'm lost. <laughs> so I think we got finally got to the bottom of this. I don't think I've explored the entire thing yet. There still might be some surprises in store, but I think we kind of got there. I haven't even explored the fourth level at all. We're just down here on the fifth. Alright, I think I'll stop recording here, and I will see you next time.